This is a KGUN 9 on your side news update. Hi everyone, Kyler Diggs here in the KGUN 9 First Morning Forecast Center. Glad to have you with us. We've got ourselves back into an active weather pattern, so let's take a look at Futurecast and see what we've got in our future. And in the immediate future for Friday, we've got some showers back in the forecast. Now these systems are coming in from the west, so they're not going to be bringing a lot of cold air with them. So snow levels will be quite high, especially with this initial wave coming in here. We'll see snow levels probably only dropping down to around 7,500 feet to about 8,000 feet. And then as we go on through the afternoon Friday, some scattered showers still will remain over the area. And then late Saturday, Saturday evening into Saturday night, another wave of moisture comes through and that will kind of dampen our Super Bowl Sunday. It looks like we'll have some showers around here on Super Bowl Sunday, along with some breezy conditions. And yeah, it will be a little bit cooler, so you may have to bring that Super Bowl party inside. Snow levels on Sunday will start to drop a little bit farther down to around 6,500 feet to 7,000 feet. And then it stays a little unstable as we head on into Monday and Tuesday. Still a slight chance of showers in there, even all the way on into Wednesday morning and then by next Thursday it looks like things clear out and we get back into more of a stable quiet weather pattern. But as far as the rainfall totals that we can expect around here initially with that first wave we'll see around a quarter of an inch to about a third of an inch in Tucson and most desert locations and then as we head on into Sunday and into the middle of next week we start to see those rain totals add up nicely for us. We could see up around three quarters of an inch in Tucson and surrounding areas will be anywhere from that quarter of an inch to three quarters of an inch and maybe a little bit more in some of the higher elevations. So let's break it down for you in the seven day forecast as far as the temperatures go. Still pretty nice really mid to upper 60s for Friday and Saturday. Saturday by the way is Groundhog Day. Doesn't look like the groundhog will see it's shadow here, so maybe an early spring, according to the groundhog. But then Super Bowl Sunday, 64 degrees for your high, breezy conditions, and then we'll take those breezy conditions into the beginning of next week with highs only in the lower 60s, so a little bit below average for this time of the year. Overnight lows will be in the 40s through the weekend, and then cooling off a little bit more into the mid to upper 30s by the middle of next week. And remember, you can always get the latest news, weather, and sports on KGUN 9 on your side, KGUN9.com, and stay connected with us on our social media outlets. And as always, it's a pleasure to have you with us.